Hello all you guys who want to buy a nice t-shirt. I know that's the only reason you clicked on this video. So I'm going to make something of a wardrobe staple so easy for you today. I'm going to make you make most of your purchase because I know all of you struggle with that a lot and I'm here to help you. Number one, perfect fit. Now when you buy a t-shirt, it has to be the perfect fit. Otherwise, it's going to look like crap. So the checklist of the perfect t-shirt is like this. Number one, it should primarily be something like what I'm wearing right now. It shouldn't be too droopy, it shouldn't be too up there because that, that's the wrong size for you. Secondly, a regular t-shirt would finish right about here, if you would see, somewhere like a little above the butt or maybe covering it a little bit. And third, what you can do is when you buy a t-shirt, make sure that the sleeve length is about three to four fingers away from your elbow. So that in case you're the kind who likes to flaunt the bicep and all of that, you can roll it up one time and use it. Next thing you need to take care of when you buy a t-shirt is the neckline. So when you have the V-neck, which I'm wearing right now, and then you have the crew neck, the classic round style, which I'm sure all of you all must have been wearing before this came into style. So when you buy a crew neck t-shirt, it's better for someone who's a little more square in their body because it creates that shape. And it also takes away from the fact that the person does not that built. Now when you take something like a v-neck, it's better for someone who's a little more built, as I said, taller and at the same time, a little more a leaner body. So depending on your shape, you select the t-shirt. So point number three is fabric. Now I know it's a little more technical, you always go to the sale rack or you want to pick up something from the basic section. All you have to do is just feel the fabric. So even if it feels like a little bit thick, but at the same time lightweight, then it's the bet for you. Now t-shirts are something that you know you're going to wear all the time. So you're going to wash it also. So make sure that the fabric is decent so when you wash it, it's not going to get ruined in the first time itself. So when you buy it, make sure it's primarily cotton because cotton is good, it feels good against the skin. You can always read the label, it's not that hard. You read it for the price so you can read for the fabric and pick it out according to obviously the color and style that I mentioned earlier. Just make sure you follow all these steps and don't be silly. Just don't be lazy and don't just head to the sale pile and buy what you can see the first thing you can grab. Take time out, go on a Sunday and pick something out that's good for yourself.